Hello, welcome to the channel. If this is your first time, kindly hit the subscribe button down below. It will help the channel grow. In this video, I'll teach you how to buy crypto on Qcoin mobile exchange app using your credit card, Visa or MasterCard, and a quick insight for their P2P trading. Let me open the app. By the way, if you haven't registered, check video description for the sign up link to get free sign up bonus. Here's how Qcoin mobile app looks like. Below will be the navigation tab like home, Markets, Trade, Future, and Assets. To buy crypto using your credit card or do P2P trading, you click on Buy Crypto Banner. Here, you select Fast Trade, P2P, or Credit or Debit Card. For Fast Trade under Buy, you can exchange token easily. Just tap on the logo to select the coin you want to exchange or vice versa. And then input the amount. Under it, you will see the amount you'll be getting. You can also sell token to fiat currency. Just select on sell. Here, you tap on the icon and just select the fiat currency you want to get from the crypto trade. Another way is buying crypto via P2P trading. Here, you can select buy or sell. And then under it, you select the coin you want to trade. They somehow have limited traders. Please check video description for P2P trading tutorial on Binance mobile app. They have more options over there. P2P trading is one of the best way to deposit or withdraw your crypto without fees, as you are selling and buying it directly to someone without the third-party assistance. And then, you can buy crypto using your debit or credit card. Select the fiat currency you want to use, and then the crypto you want to buy. Input the amount you want to purchase. Below, you'll see related credit card payments that are provided like Simplex and others, which is a separate third-party platform for crypto purchases. Once agreed with the price and the amount you'll be getting, just tap on Confirm. And you will be redirected to a web page to complete the transaction. Just input your contact details and proceed with the payment using your Visa or MasterCard. And then under orders, you will see the records of pending and completed purchases. Alright, that's all for this video. If you have questions, feel free to comment down below. And please don't forget to like. Smash the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for more cryptocurrency video tutorials. See you on my next video.